It's hard to think of anything missing from the Oscar-winning Spider-Man Into the Spider-Verse. Not only did it redefine what fans thought they knew about our favorite wall crawler, but it also managed to introduce an entire multiverse of Spideys all in one movie. I'm Sean Steele with FandomWire.com, your number one source for all things entertainment, and there's one Spidey who ended up on the cutting room floor. Though the movie did include two Peter Parkers, sadly our very own Marvel Cinematic Universe Spider-Man, Tom Holland, didn't make the final cut. Yes, Tom Holland was actually going to make a cameo in Spider-Man Into the Spider-Verse. He described the scene as literally just a walk-by cameo, and it's still unclear if we would have actually heard Tom Holland voicing the character, but an Easter egg like that would have sent fan adoration for Spider-Verse to a whole new level. Spider-Verse indicated that every Spider-Man to ever exist is contained within the multiverse explored during the course of the movie. So to have it confirmed that the Marvel Cinematic Universe Spider-Man is part of one of those connected realities would have been mind-blowing, not just for Spider-Man fans, but for moviegoers in general. The current Peter Parker did, however, express his fondness for Spider-Vs' Spider-Man, Miles Morales, and pondered the possibility of the character even swinging over into the MCU anytime soon. Spider-Man Into the Spider-Verse is available everywhere on digital download, Blu-ray, DVD. The film picked up the Academy Award for Best Animated Movie, as well as a number of other awards in Best Animated Film, Production Design, Directing, and Visual Effects. Currently, Tom Holland is promoting his next Marvel Studios film, Spider-Man Far From Home. This movie will actually also introduce the multiverse into the Marvel Cinematic Universe, despite Doctor Strange actually touching on it a bit back in 2016. In addition to Holland, the movie also stars Samuel L. Jackson, Zendaya, Kobe Smulders, John Favreau, Marissa Tomei, Jacob Batalon, and Jake Gyllenhaal. Spider-Man Far From Home hits theaters on July 2nd. And us here at Fandom Wire want to know what you guys think. Would this have been too confusing to the average moviegoer? Do you think it was a good idea just to leave it out entirely? Or would you have liked to see Tom Holland cameo in Spider-Man Into the Spider-Verse? And as always, if you guys like this video, give it a thumbs up, give it a share, and make sure you're following Fandom Wire on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and YouTube. Uh.